Hi guys, it's Breast Cancer Awareness Month and in honor I wanted to create a special video. This is a little different, I feel a little vulnerable sharing it with you guys. Um, it's important to me though to share my family's experience with breast cancer in hope of helping others. So, take a look. My battle with breast cancer was 19 years ago this December mm -hmm. and it came out of nowhere. Uh, it was quite a surprise to myself and our family and um, I think it started as a nightmare but it became an amazing journey and part of that, though that's hard to believe that could be possible, was due to the support of everyone around me. Uh, family, friends, neighbors, our community rallied for us um, in ways that taught me a lot about caring and giving. People gave gifts of themselves in ways that they could and that were meaningful and helpful and kept our family sustained with hope and prayer and food and yeah. uh, companionship. And at the time, Carly and her sisters were very young. Um, Carly was in preschool. Yeah, I was so little, but I remember all of the support. I could think of hundreds of ways that people helped yeah. our family to, to sustain normalcy, to just try yeah. and be normal as a family in as many ways as possible so that I could keep battling uh, what I had to do. I'm so grateful for the technology and the research uh, that was able to help you in your fight against breast cancer. Back in September, during the craziness of New York Fashion Week, we as a family all came together and did the Race for the Cure in New York. It was a really special day. Good morning! We are on our way to Central Park for the Susan G. Komen 5K Race for the Cure and the entire Kloss clan is squeezed in one car. Um, we have t-shirts, we have snacks, we're ready to go. <laughs> Just passed through the, the starting gate and now 5K is ahead. In a about. sea of pink. And support and emotion and yeah, excitement. It's very emotional. It is. <laughs> Just seeing all the all the family members of people either who have been affected by breast cancer or lost their life to breast cancer or Winning survived. Their battles. And wearing that survivor shirt proudly. Going through this is tough. Going through it with support and constant hope and constant rallying makes a big difference. So I think that's what, um, to me, it also meant supporting those who are going through their battles now as much as uh, celebrating the survivors. Yay, girls! Woo! Amazing. Why did you all volunteer? Why are you out here today? Why not? Why not? <laughs> to support the boys. It's an amazing and cause. Well, thank you. Thank Bye, you. girls. Bye. I share this video with you guys today and I share our story because I want it to be a reminder to encourage you guys out there to get checked, to get screened, and to encourage your loved ones, your parents, to also get checked for breast cancer and to be grateful for life because life is precious and yes. I feel so grateful that I have you. We're going to make something really fresh and delicious and healthy and I'm going to show you how to do it. To make apple crisp, preheat the oven to 375 degrees. For the filling. 